Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys my makeup routine. I feel like I haven't showed you like an in-depth makeup routine. So let's start off with skin prep, which is what I do before putting on my makeup. Um, actually, you know what? Let me tie my hair up back first. I use these clips from the brand Revell. I think that's how you say it. I don't know. But I just use two of them to pin my hair back like so. One like that. Bruh. Okay, so that my hair is pinned back so it doesn't get in my face. Sometimes I also use this headband, but I'm not really feeling the headband today. So with skin prep, it's literally just by using moisturizer. So for my moisturizer, I use this aloe vera gel, which I really find that works for my skin. You can get this gel from Walmart or you can get it from like a South Asian store, which is usually where I get mine. I think my mom bought this one from Walmart. <laughs> dab it around my face if i'm being like completely honest i don't really use primer that much i don't really use primer so i'm just gonna skip that because i barely use primer it's just my moisturizer that i use i like to switch my foundation a lot i usually use the fit me foundation which i think i got it from walmart and then the shape tape tart today i'm feeling let's go with the shape tape tart. It's just like a pump I just pump it like twice. I think twice is good enough. Dab it on my face. I have like so many dots around my face, but that's how I apply it. I never use a brush to apply my foundation. I always use a sponge. what color i got this in i got this in 45 h tan honey there it is 40 h tan honey so i have my foundation set and on and then i like to go with elf camo concealer and apply it under my eye like so and in between my brows and then like right on my nose just so i can make like the slim nose look effect like that okay that's good then i like to go with another beauty blender my beauty blenders are really dirty like I cleaned them in like i think a month ago but they're already super dirty again so now i like to blend my nose which i also use my beauty blender to blend it but for my nose the thing is i don't blend it all the way you can still see the concealer on my nose i don't want to like blend it too much but then i like to go with my contour stick i use a super thin brush it's like an eyebrow brush i think it is an eyebrow brush but and then like do that Okay, do you guys see that? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, maybe I might have messed up this part, but it's fine. We can just blend that in later. Oh shoot, I didn't tell you where I got my contour. So my contour is by the brand Fit Me, and it's in the shade Coconut 355. So then for my baking powder, I like to use the Bare Minerals Matte, and it's in medium 10. I let everything fall down to the cap, I guess. Now we have a lot of baking powder, I guess. I go with a different kind of beauty blender brush like that so while that sits i like to do my brows now anesthesia dip brow which everyone uses for their brows and then i use this thin brush so that's literally all i do i just fill my brows in and fill the like front part by doing like upwards gosh motions now let us blend in my baking powder so now i'm gonna blend in my contour wait oops why did i use this brow brush blend in my contour my nose my contour on my nose i use this one i like fold it and then i blend it in like that i'm gonna use my makeup wipe just to remove the excess makeup or foundation on my lips 
cute. I love how pink my lips look after I put on foundation and take off the Axis foundation with my makeup wipes. My p lips look so much more pink. So that's it for like the foundation part. I get questions asking what I use under my eye. I use the NYX Professional Makeup Eyeliner, which I got from Amazon for like $9. So that I just like to put it under my eye just to make my eyes look more bigger. Oh, I just put on that. It looks so cute. I love that. What do I usually do next? For my blush, I usually go with the She Glam Clear and Bright Liquid Brush, which I got from Sheen. And you guys are probably like, what the heck? She uses Sheen makeup. Sheen makeup is actually pretty good, not gonna lie. I'm not judging their makeup because I love it so much. First, I was like, a little bit hesitant on buying their blush, but it's actually pretty good. I like to dab it right on my cheekbones. I like to do it going up so that it gives like the lifted look. Also apply it on my nose. that and then like that and this is what i used to blend in my blush once i'm done with the blush i like to use the Too faced you light my life love light highlighter i don't know why to call that but put it on the bridge put it underneath my brows Highlight is definitely my favorite part of my makeup routine. I know this is kind of like random, but sometimes if I'm wearing like a low cut top or like a v-neck, a low v-neck top, I like to put some highlight on my collarbone just because it makes it pop out more. Now I'm going with the Lash Princess Essence Mascara which I got from Amazon I've seen this on TikTok and it really does wonders Because if you have like really short eyelashes like me Then you guys should definitely get in one of these Alright, so I did that This is an extra step which I've also learned from TikTok If you guys want like more of like a doll makeup look with the eyes you can bring the bottom of your eyelashes together you'll see how i'm like using my tweezer to to um connect two lashes together i don't really do this all the time but i just decided to show you guys today now let's go on with mas not mascara i mean eyeliner i use this the she glam eyeliner which i also got from sheen and this one's really good because it has a stamp to draw the wing so if you're really bad at drawing wings just stamp it and then it works like that oh god i'm shaking and then i just connect it with the other end which is just like the pencil part i don't do it on my eyelid just because i have these lashes on and they're really hard to like remove it so i just do it like right at the end it's so hard to get the wings even oh my god <laughs> the stamp didn't even work that time so I have both my eyeliner completes, my eye makeup. Oh, it's just the inner corner of my eye. For the inner corner of my eye, I also use the She Glam um, highlighter. It's like that. It's not too much, but it's not too little. And we're not done yet because now we gotta do lips. So for my lips, I don't do overlining and stuff like that because I don't know how. Plus, I don't think it looks good on me. Even though I do have like um, a pencil for that. But literally, for my lips, I like to use the H2O Gloss by Tarte. And it looks really natural and also super glossy. I'm gonna take this bad boy off. My hair looks crazy. Oh my god, the pink. Also, for the final touch, I like to use the Paradise Setting Spray. Wow, I missed that. And that concludes the video. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and a thumbs up. I am posting on Thursdays now so instead of just Sundays. So make sure you have your notifications on. Subscribe if you're new. And yeah, see you guys in my next video. Bye.